Let's talk about how the proposed cuts to NASA's budget could affect space exploration and astronomy if they're passed. ESA announced at a press conference today that at least three large joint space missions will be threatened by the budget cuts. LISA, a space-based gravitational wave detector that will study black holes and binary stars to test Einstein's theory of general relativity and was expected to be operational by the early 2030s. Envision, a mission to orbit and study Venus in detail. And New Athena, the largest ever X-ray observatory that could continue the legacy and amazing science done by the Chandra X-ray Observatory. These missions have been in planning and development for at least 10 years, and ESA said that the proposed cuts to NASA would mean the missions would either have to be frozen or possibly cancelled. A further 16 joint missions would be affected by the cuts, but ESA sees ways of mitigating some of the damage there. The effect on multiple NASA missions has been documented elsewhere, but today the director of the National Solar Observatory announced at the American Astronomical Society meeting in Alaska that the world's most powerful solar telescope, the Daniel K. Inouye Solar Telescope, or DKIST, would no longer be able to operate if the current budget request passes. The observatory cost about $30 million to operate this year, and the director said there's no way to operate such a complex facility on the $13 million that's proposed for 2026. The telescope was 25 years in the making and only came online in 2020 and represents the best ground-based tool we have to study our star. These are just a few of the impacts of the proposed cuts and there are many, many more. The Planetary Society has done a great job of cataloging the impacts and I recommend heading over to their website if you want to learn more. I don't think anybody would argue that we shouldn't try to be as efficient as possible with taxpayer dollars and review what we're spending on science in the US. But the kind of random wholesale cuts to NASA and all the other science that are being proposed make absolutely no sense to me. I hardly need to say this, as I'm sure you're already on your way down to the comments, but please know, let me know what you think below. That's today's video. I will see you back here tomorrow.